Hey guys, what's up? Uh, let's do this video on how to reset the service engine zoom light. Uh, basically, um, what you're gonna do is, uh, you're gonna have your car off. The car's gonna be off, right? All right, so you're gonna turn your car on the on position without putting anything, without, you know, um, turning on the engine on. So it's gotta be just uh, in the on position. Wait three seconds, all right? Just count. One, one thousand, two, one thousand, three, one thousand. What you're gonna do is you're gonna press five times on the accelerator uh, pedal. One, one thousand, two, one thousand. You know, just, just you have to press it five times within five seconds. So it really doesn't matter how fast you do it. You can do one after another. One, two, three, four, five. Just within five seconds, just do that. All right. And then after that, you wait seven seconds, right? One, one thousand, two, one thousand, three, one thousand, four, one thousand, five, one thousand, six, one thousand, seven, one thousand. And then after that, you're gonna press the accelerator um, uh, pedal and you're gonna rest your foot on there for about 10 to 14 seconds until uh, the service engine light blinks. Once it blinks, you can then take your foot off, turn it off, and turn it back on, and that should be set. Um, the pedal for you guys. So I'm gonna go through this uh, live uh, demonstration right now. So basically the car is off, right? You're gonna turn the car on, and on does not mean that the clock light is on. On means that, you know, that the whole entire light is on. So one, two, three, all right, foot pedal, one, two, three, four, five, and then count to seven, one, one thousand, two, one thousand, three, one thousand, four, one thousand, five, one thousand, six, one thousand, seven, one thousand. All right, so put your foot on the, on the accelerator, one, one thousand, two, one thousand, three, one thousand, four, one thousand, five, one thousand. So here it is, uh, uh, it's blinking immediately. Uh, normally it takes about 10 to 14 seconds for it to blink. So since it's, um, why did it stop blinking? Um, it's not blinking. It's not supposed to do that. All right, let me try it again. All right, it's 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 off, right? It's on. All right, so here you go. One, two, three. One, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. All right, so put your foot on the uh, accelerator. One two, three, four. So it's blinking right now. You can just see it, it's blinking. So, so, all right, so you guys take it, turn it off, and then turn it back on. All right, guys, that's how you do it. Uh, so normally that light just goes off, uh, and if it doesn't go off, you're gonna have to keep on doing that until it does go off. So in this case, it did go off. But, um, you know, uh, you do it a couple of times, it will turn the light off. Or if you guys have an issue that, um, it, you know, one of these issues where, you know, there might be uh, a huge emissions leak in your car and uh, that light probably is going to stay on for quite a while. But normally, if I wanted to uh, do this um, without, um, going through the whole pedal thing um, I just pretty much just use a cold beater for that and uh, I found it a lot more convenient uh, normally I don't like uh, cold um, on my car so what I normally do is you know erase codes and it's erased and as you guys can see that's off and it'll be off if you guys caught my other video, it'll be off in maybe a couple days. Any, any, uh, it'll be off like.